get ready for the dictation dictation will start in 5 seconds start mr vice chairman first of all i must place on record my grateful thanks to the university grants commission for the work that they have done for the advancement of higher education they have done good work and in full cooperation with the education ministry this i think must encourage state governments to establish university grants commission or committees in their respective states what the country needs most is the coordinated efforts of the autonomous university grants commissions working in harmony with the state governments and university authorities coordinated efforts are needed to bring about certain uniformity in the standards of university education without that our educational advancement is bound to suffer from various tensions and difficulties i do agree with my friend that the annual report under discussion is rather a dull report at least it is not as bright as the two previous reports were in the previous two reports the university grants commission invited the attention of the nation to certain academic problems to certain educational needs unfortunately in this report the university grants commission confines its remarks mostly to what has been achieved in the field of university education under the guidance and with the assistance of the university grants commission however sir it is not possible for me to agree with mr santanam that the university grants commission should not extend help to universities for the preservation of manuscripts manuscripts are of great importance so far as university libraries are concerned it is the duty of universities to preserve those manuscripts and it is the duty of the university grants commission to extend to universities the necessary financial assistance for maintaining and preserving the manuscripts in good order also it is not possible for me sir to agree with my friend that today universities are enjoying too much of autonomy i agree with the university grants commission which 2 years ago remarked that freedom is vital for education and democracy and i personally feel sir that no one pili or the other university autonomy and academic freedom are being restricted rather than being extended as they must be i do not think sir that a social purpose or a social value can be imparted in the teaching by a teacher through the imposition of restrictions on his freedom of thinking i feel that teachers need academic freedom for discharging their duties in an efficient way stop